Hello West Ham Network, happy May, it's Holly and I'm here with your Hammers headlines for today, Wednesday the 1st of May, running association with the brilliant guys at KUMB.com. Let's get started. <laughs> Yes, you will have seen this week that Cresswell was said to have rejected a one-year contract extension with West Ham, but the Athletic are now reporting that West Ham are actually hopeful that Cress will remain for one more season. So to recap, we turned down Wolves' £1 million offer for Cresswell last summer, and we've ended up needing to use him, so it's a good thing that we did hang on to him in the end. But would you like to see Cresswell stay, or do you think it's a sign of us hanging on for that bit too long when we should and could be spending the money on younger talent? Let us know below in the comments. Johnson, on the other hand, is is said to be expected to leave the club on a free when his contract is, expires at the end of the season. So it's been reported that his agents have met with Rangers, Palace and Leeds, and he'd definitely be a big one to lose as he works as such a versatile backup player. But although he's not, he's playing well, but he's not likely to break into our starting, usual starting 11 anyway. So it's understandable. I believe he's 24 years of age. He is going to be keen to be getting regular game time and go and push on in his career and West Ham might not be the club that allows him to do that so it's going to be interesting to see how much we can get for him given that he has been coming off the bench a fair bit and he does play well when he plays for us so will you be sad to see Johnson leave and if so do you think we should have given him more game time to try and keep him or do you just see him as a backup and nothing more and it's just that we've come to the end of the road with him let us know below in that comment section you know what to do Now, despite countless rumours that Paqueta will leave in the summer, with City said to have been lurking for a long, long time now, and fans expecting big money offers to come in for him in the next transfer window, Paqueta has come out and insisted that he is in fact happy at West Ham. So his quote when speaking to ESPN was, I have to do my job here at West Ham. I have enormous respect for the club. I'm very happy here. If I say I'm not, I'd be lying. So that's great to hear. Obviously, it's not going to stop interest from other clubs, but it's really good to hear that he's remaining professional and focused on the job at hand. And I'd absolutely love to see him remain as a hammer for the foreseeable. But with his rumoured release clause, it's going to be interesting to see which teams show interest this summer and which we obviously have to have to give him to. And finally, Spartak Moscow is said to be after David Moyes' signature, meaning we could see him heading to Russia after the season ends, if reports to be believed. So while the Russian side have inquired about Moyes' availability after sacking their manager earlier in April, Moyes is said to be reluctant to commit, is how it's being worded at this moment in time. And I can't say I'm massively surprised, seeing as he's yet to have talks, obviously, with West Ham at the end of the season about the next steps, even if it now seems pretty inevitable that he's going to be leaving. Plus, I imagine he's going to want to see which other other offers are on the table and which other teams come in for him, seeing as he's going to be a free agent if he leaves West Ham. And the uh, I'm sure he will have many opportunities. It'll just be interesting to see what kind of opportunities they are. So there you have it. Those are your three Hammers headlines for today. I hope you've enjoyed this video. Please give it a thumbs up if you've enjoyed it. And don't forget to leave a comment below with your thoughts. If you're new around here, make sure you've subscribed. And if you haven't already, make sure you check out Alloy Collectors because they've got some brilliant, brilliant, brilliant products. The guys already mentioned it, but Father's Day is coming up. So it's very exciting, very exciting present that you could give your loved West Ham ones. But I hope you have an amazing day. Whatever you're up to, make sure you check out KUMB.com if you haven't already. And until next time, come on, you irons.